Welcome to Stone Watching. Today we're talking about Spider-Man No Way Home trailer number two. And if you haven't already, please smash the subscribe button and click on that bell so you can notify for future videos. And be sure to give this video a thumbs up. And yes, the brand new trailer for Spider-Man No Way Home has finally arrived. So let's check it out. Ever since I got bit by that spider, I've only had one week where my life has felt normal. That was when you found out. When you botched that spell where you wanted everyone to forget the Peter Parker Spider-Man. We started getting some visitors. From every universe. Hello, Peter. You're not Peter Parker. I'm sorry, what was your name again? Dr. Otto Octavius. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, no, seriously, what's your actual name? There are others out there. We need to send them back. So, Scooby-Doo this crap. You know, all this is kind of your mess. I know a couple of magic words myself, starting with the word please. Please, Scooby-Doo this crap. You're flying out into the darkness to fight ghosts. What do you mean? They all die fighting Spider-Man. It's their fate. I'm sorry, kid. Yeah, me too. Don't. Look, there has to be another way. There isn't. They're a danger to our universe. You're not gonna take this away from me. Peter. You're struggling. Damn it. You want while the world tries to make you choose. This is all my fault. I can't save everyone. They're starting to come through, and I can't stop them. December 17th, exclusively at movie theaters. Tickets on sale November 29th. Spider Monday. Spider Monday. Wow, man, that was pretty damn cool. Now, I have to say, I don't know if I'm, like, bummed or not about no sign of Tobey Maguire or Andrew Garfield in that trailer whatsoever. So... I don't know. I heard somebody earlier on talking that like there was like one scene with the uh, lizard when he was jumping out at Tom Holland's Spider-Man. If you look, I think it was like the international trailer or something like that. You could actually see like part of it to where he gets hit in the head, but there's nothing there. So there's some people speculating that there might be some character that was there that was digitally taken out, which I really don't understand. Because if you got these two other Spider-Men in this movie why wouldn't you put them on the trailer because i heard somebody say if you put them two in the trailer they will sell all the tickets for this movie so why wouldn't you put them in this trailer or are you planning on putting out a third trailer before this movie hits so i don't know let me just think about that in the comments down below now while i do think this does look pretty damn good i'm hoping that this movie does not fall prey to the spider-man 3 and the Amazing Spider-Man 2 problem where there were so many villains and there's only one Spider-Man. Now, I remember throughout this whole entire time with Tom Holland and Spider-Man in the MCU, I've heard people complain that, you know, he's not being Spider-Man. He's just not being by himself. You know, why can't he be just by himself? What's the point about him being in the MCU if the other characters in the MCU don't show up in his movie, right? I mean, I thought that was the whole entire point of him coming into the MCU was that so the other characters would be in his movie. Now, I'm not saying that they should be the focus of his movie. I think he should be the focus of the movie. And that's like a debate on whether or not if you think that the first one was like all Iron Man or not, right? I don't know. I like 
Tom Holland Spider-Man. I like the MCU Spider-Man movies, and I cannot wait to see this one. So did you see the new trailer for Spider-Man No Way Home? Let me know in the comments down below. What do you think? Do you think that Tobey Maguire and Andrew Garfield are going to show up? Let me know in the comments down below. I don't know, man. I can't wait to see this movie, so let me know what you think in the comments down below.